Hey guys, it's Medicosis Perfect Snellus, where medicine makes perfect sense. Today, it's time to talk about collagen, which is an important protein in the extracellular matrix. What does that mean? It means that this is my cell right here, and here is another cell right here. Outside the cell is called the extracellular space. It has matrix, connective tissue, such as collagen, and elastin among others where can we find collagen in your hair in your bone in your cartilage in your blood vessel even in the basement membrane upon which the cell stands this is part of my clinical biochemistry playlist please try to watch these videos in order in my anatomy videos we talked about bones and we talked about cartilages both bones and cartilages come from the mesoderm, but it's not just bone and cartilage. Tendons, ligaments, muscles, all of them come from the mesenchyme. When you hear the word mesenchyme, think of mesoderm. Here is the mesoderm of the embryo. You know what the word meso mean? It means in the middle. Do you remember the midbrain in your brain? It's called the mesencephalon. Meso means middle central the mesoderm will give you bones cartilages muscles tendons the wall of the blood vessel and lymph vessel kidneys and ureters and the dermis of your skin the cortex of your adrenal gland and the dura mater which surrounds your brain and spinal cord how do you grow up well your skeleton grows up your bones will grow and the cartilages will die and upon that death we will add new bone formation Bone is hard, but cartilage is less hard. We call that firm. Hard is like touching the forehead, but firm is like touching the tip of your nose. Not as hard as your forehead. Bones have type 1 collagen, cartilages have type 2 collagen. So, quick review on the types of collagen. Type 1, bone. Type 2, cartilage, I mean cartilage. Type 3, look how flexible this is blood vessels. Type 4, under the floor, in the basement membrane. Type 5, many tissues like hair, placenta, etc. Please pause and review. Once you memorize these, let's add more. Type 1, we said bone, but what else? How about the number one layer in your eye? You mean the cornea? Exactly. And your skin. And then something in your teeth, dentin. What's under your skin? Fascia. And how do muscles attach to bones? tendons they also have type 1 collagen after i injure myself if it was a bad injury i will develop a scar this scar contains type 1 collagen as you might have imagined type 1 collagen is very strong next type 2 in the cartilage and nucleus pulposus of your intervertebral disc and the vitreous body of your eye type 3 we said blood vessels what else scar tissue before it gets converted to type 1. So in early wound repair, we have type 3 collagen. Later, we convert type 3 collagen into type 1 collagen. Quiz time. What would you call the enzyme that breaks down collagen? Collagenase? Brilliant. Type 4, under the floor, in the basement membrane, it's also in the lens of your eye. So the cornea of the eye has type 1. The vitreous body of the eye has type 2. The lens of your eye has type 4 collagen. How do you make collagen? Remember, it's a protein, right? Just like insulin. Pre-pro-insulin, then pro-insulin, then good old insulin. But here it's just a longer process. Pre-pro-collagen, then pro-collagen, Look at this lovely triple helix. After the procollagen, we have tropocollagen, collagen fibrils, followed by collagen fibers. There are three amino acids that are important in collagen synthesis. The most important is glycine. And then we usually have proline and lysine. Hydroxylation means adding hydroxyl groups. Key enzyme needed is hydroxylase key vitamin needed vitamin c and that's why patients who have scurvy have problems in their hair they bleed because they have problem in, in their vessels because remember that collagen type 3 is present in vessels after hydroxylation we gotta make it sweet it's called glycosylation glyco means sugar like glucose then kick it out of the cell exocytosis pro collagen is longer than tropocollagen 
So by going from this step to this step, I'm getting shorter. What do you call this? Proteolytic processing, breaking down. Just like fibrinogen and fibrin. Fibrin is shorter than fibrinogen. If you want to go from fibrinogen to fibrin, you break down. And then what's the final step? Cross-linking. Cross-linking is problematic in patients with Menke's disease, which is a copper defect, which we have discussed before in my video on copper deficiency. Have you watched my video on osteogenesis imperfecta? Because that's a collagen disease. You'll find this video in this clinical biochemistry playlist. And you will find my video on vitamin C in the biochemistry playlist and Alport syndrome in the nephrology playlist. All of these affect the collagen. If you recall from my video on Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, we have many subtypes of this disease, such as hypermobility type, classical type, vascular type, and others. In classical type, there is problem with type 5 collagen. These patients suffer from skin problems and joint problems. But how about the vascular type? Oh, the problem is in type 3, and type 3 is present in vessels. They get weak vessels. They get aneurysms. Their vessel wall is weak, so blood is going to extravasate and ooze out. They get bruises or ecchymoses. Pre-pro-collagen, then pro-collagen, and then collagen. Pre-pro-insulin, then pro-insulin, then insulin. Do you want to know how insulin works? What are the different types of insulin? How can you calculate the dose of insulin? Do you want to understand the difference between type 1 and type 2 diabetes? Learn about diabetic ketoacidosis, thyroid hormone, and much more. Download my endocrine pharmacology course at medicosisperfectionalis.com. To learn how your kidney functions, remember that the basement membrane there has collagen type 4, download my renal physiology course on my website. If you do not want to download my courses but would rather watch them right here on YouTube, click the join button and choose the highest tier to gain instant access to more than 300 premium videos right now. Please subscribe, smash like, hit the bell, support my channel here or here, go to my website to download my courses, notes and cases, or if you'd like me to personally tutor you. Thank you for watching, be safe, stay happy, study hard. This is Medicosis Perfectionatus, where medicine makes perfect sense.